hospital room where Queen Juliana gave birth as foreign territory. And so they saved the little baby from Canadian citizenship. <laughs> now, most of the time that's not something to avoid, but in this case definitely was. And so after the war, uh, the Netherlands thanked Canada both for protecting the royal family and for, of course, the help of the Canadian troops in liberating Holland by sending 10,000 tulip bulbs for us to plant that fall. The year after that, Princess Juliana sent thousands of bulbs herself as a personal gift to the city. And from there it took off so that every uh, year at this time, many homes would have tons of tulips in the yard. And, well, we thought at one point, let's make a festival around this. I think you know, a lot of people would want to see it. So even to this day, we have this tulip festival and this lovely tradition of filling our parks with tulips in memory of this friendship and this loyalty between Canada and the Netherlands. So even to this day, the grandson of Princess Juliana, uh, Wilhelm Alexander, King Wilhelm Alexander, still keeps up the tradition, not sending quite as many tulip bulbs, not certainly in the range of 10,000, but certainly enough to make it worth keeping the tradition alive.
until our next vlog. Yes. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs>